All right, you guys ready? Man, this place is pure. Helmet, like five feet. You like the little smoke? Opened up, there we go. And then show me good. I mean, honestly, pretty good. Basically, right now we are on the way to ECPC, which is Callaway's Performance Center. That's kind of hidden in this area, which is really fun. And we're going to be doing a live shoot with the Callaway guys for about an hour and a half. We're filming a bunch of instructional content, so I'm excited for that. I've been filming content for, I want to say, 10 years now. But this is somehow the first time I'm actually going to have an entire camera crew with me and not just a one-shot camera. I mean, honestly, a little bit of nerves just because I haven't ever had a full team getting me from every angle, but at the same time, pretty exciting because it means it's the next step forward in our, you know, golf instruction business. We're strengthening our relationship with Callaway, but at the same time, they're telling everybody pretty much that what we're doing is good and our our instruction is, uh, is top notch. I love how they mentioned that the uh, performance center is a little hidden. As you're driving on the hill, I think I just saw the building for it. Really? And then it's just some random dead end and there's a driving range here and here we are. You find it okay? Everything's good. I like this little uh, hidden gym. Uh, should I bust out these clubs for you now? Your stuff? Yeah. Uh, you can take everything else, yeah, sure. How we doing? Good, good. Sure. How you doing? Shaheen. Nice to meet you. Shaheen, nice to meet you. Back to set. Man, this place is pure. First swing with the new equipment. I'm stiff as a brick. That was like virtually off the hosel. Lovely. Alright, you guys ready? You like the little uh, smoke? Oh, that's sweet. Oh, this is yeah. sweet. Tough battle between, I'm like everyone else, you know, do I want the good looking ones or do I want the ones that actually fit for me the best? <laughs> yeah, I mean, dude, that's a, that's a sweet looking club right there. Fine. Show him too. Make sure that I can't mark. Oh, okay. he's got over there. Okay, so you can't block that. Okay. On his wide shot, we'll see it. Okay. Man, this is amazing. I mean, five years of working with Shaheen. You know, starting in our basement in Saint Michel, and then the office next to IKEA, and now Callaway's flying us out. It's like. It's done really, you know? Seeing it happen, I'm really happy for him and I'm proud of us. How do you want me to, how do you guys want me to intro the videos? Like, is there something in particular you guys want me to say to start the videos off that you guys would like? Introduce your name and say, I would say like I'm here in the EV Callaway Performance Center. And then you could say, here's why. And Yeah, the there's, I mean, there's two main reasons and I'm yeah. gonna talk about both of them in the video, so. What are those two reasons? The first one would be a wide open club face. The second one is the path getting too far across the ball. So for me, again, as a right-handed golfer, this would basically mean that I'm swinging too far left. Now, the starting point of this, the chain reaction typically evolves from the club face being too open. And so what we need to do is we need to start the chain by getting this club face more closed. No, I don't like the way I was explaining that. Oh, I'll, I'll keep riffing and just restart. You guys still rolling? Yeah. Keep rolling. All right, here we go. You in three, two, one. Hey guys, Shaheen here at the Ely Callaway Performance Center in Carlsbad, California. It is a beautiful day. We are here to correct your slice. And so what we need to do is we need to start the chain by getting this club face more closed. But if I'm going to be standing here and I make this bigger turn, my hands will naturally start to work much more around my body, which will actually help me to keep this club inside my hands coming down and having that ball be struck from the inside. We're gonna get over this ball. We're gonna feel one or two times making a bigger turn, which will feel like the arms are much more what we would call flat or behind us. 
once you're ready to go. Obviously, this would be more of the extreme exaggeration, but you can see how I hit the ball in the complete opposing direction from where you would typically be struggling. That's a snap hook if I've ever snapped one. <laughs> Keep it short too, because Make people will see you hit your shot and then they turn it off. Like if anything, that outro, people will stop watching and then messes up the game. But, so what's funny is like, if you go watch any of my instruction videos, I never swing a club because I don't want to put that pressure of having to yeah. replicate it. Like at the end for like an outro, not even just like, just do that a few times, like something like to that extent. It could be a one liner. Right. Yeah. yeah. And two and three, two, one. So once you feel nice and comfortable with the rehearsals, we're going to start the process of hitting this golf ball. So we're going to walk into the ball one more time. So we're going to start this off by hitting more of a half or three quarter shot just to get that sensation. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. You can see I finished a lot more balance on my front and you can see that my strike gets a lot better and the start line control gets a lot better as well. Time to start grinding. One take on the first two clips, I like it. Or one take after the first like 30 seconds. I mean, honestly, pretty good. Uh, I say we go in for some inserts with Miles' camera. Sean, do we have another 24 to 70? Oh yeah. So that is so me bad. Opened up, there we go. Cool. That gives us everything. We're good. The yeah, pop planes aren't airplane too bad. Is. How often are they flying off? Yeah, I'm gonna take it off. Oh, no, nah, you just, just shake it. You can't it. see that. Two, and three, two, one. Hey guys, Shaheen here at the Ely Callaway Performance Center. This is obviously no surprise that most people will struggle with a slice. I'm hearing that way too much. It's because you jinxed it, by the way. All right, let's cut. <laughs> 